Tinkercad Tips, we've been talking about 3D printed chain mail and flexible fabric designs. In my prior tutorial, I showed you one that was made from a hexagon, a three-sided shape. This one is very similar, except I have added these additional little triangular tabs out here. And when we look at the whole field, it gives kind of a different look and feel to it. If we come back here to our individual length, let's move this over here. Let's make a duplicate of it. Slide that over. Let's ungroup that. You can see on each of these corners here, I've added these little individual triangles to sort of fill in the center when all of these links come together. And again, if we look at the center portion of this and how that's created, there is this hexagonal hole in the center of it to hollow it out. And then there's two sets of these triangles. Let's see if we can isolate this here. There's one on top and then let's focus in on this. There's one below. And that's how I made the individual links. Go ahead and delete those. And again, if we zoom in here and look, the underneath there's a significant gap between everything so that there's some mobility some flexibility and I've left enough room even in the centers here that when you bend this this should move so I printed this up let me go and show you what this looked like when I 3d printed it in my prior tutorial I showed you this design it's the same hexagonal links and it was very open. There's a lot of spacing in between here, and the, the centers are, are very um, open as well. So what this is, this is basically the same thing, except I added those triangles into everything, so it closed out that pattern a bit more. And you can see here, this is still quite flexible, and it gives it kind of a nice triangular design. The back of it you can see where that's open it doesn't have those triangles on it so that's what that one looked like this one worked out pretty well I have a few more examples to show you up here again some that worked a couple that didn't work so well so like follow share um, if you have any comments be sure to drop me a comment on any of these and as always we'll see you in the next one